Welcome to our 2012 year-end housing market update. The Greater Vancouver housing market experienced below average home sale totals, typical home listing activity, and modest declines in home prices in 2012. There were 25,032 homes sold on the region's MLS in 2012. That's the second lowest total we've seen in the region since 2000, and 25% below the 10-year average in Greater Vancouver. The number of homes listed for sale in 2012 maintained pace with historic averages. All totaled, there were 58,379 homes listed on the Greater Vancouver's MLS last year, which is 6% above the 10-year average. Today it's taking, on average, 73 days for a home to sell in Greater Vancouver. That's the highest we've seen in the last three years. As you can see here, home prices were on the rise to begin the year in Greater Vancouver. They increased to an all-time high in the first five months and began a modest decline in the latter half of the year. After reaching a peak in May of 625100 the benchmark price for all residential properties in the region declined nearly 6%. The largest declines have occurred in the detached home market in Richmond and the west side of Vancouver, and in the apartment markets in Whistler and West Vancouver. When reviewing home prices, it's important to know that changes and trends will differ based on municipality and property type. So it's critical that you do your homework and consult your realtor before making your home buying or selling decision. For further housing market information, go to the News and Statistics section of this website. For the Real Estate Board of Greater Vancouver, I'm Eugene Klein.